everyone, it's Agnes and I've got a story, a male specific person success story today. It's from, we're going to call him Jim. Okay, it goes like this. Dear Agnes, finally after 11 months, me and my specific person are now back together and much stronger and happier. We've been together now for two months and we celebrated our eight year anniversary last February 2019. This is my story. It all began eight years ago. Me and my babe became official on Valentine's Day, February 14th, 2011. We love each other so much and we were happy. My family likes her and my and her family likes me. We have many plans and promises. I was shocked last year, February 1st, 2018, when suddenly she told me that she's breaking up with me. I was devastated. My heart broke into a million pieces. My weight dropped from 170 pounds to 155 pounds in just three weeks. And I was so depressed. I was really hurt and I thought I was going to die. I was looking for ways on how to get her back and I kept on searching how to get your ex back in Google and YouTube to give me some ideas on how to win her back and to give myself hope that we will be together again. I made all kinds of mistakes, begging, pleading, crying, asking her friends and relatives to help me win her back, blaming her for everything, and I even knelt in front of her. I did all those mistakes over and over again for 10 months. May 2018 is when I first saw your video. Honestly, I just followed your video because I was desperate for a result. I also followed other law of attraction and dating coaching experts, but decided to stick with your videos because your videos are unique. I've watched almost all of your videos and it gives me encouragement that if others did it, so could I. I first did your X back meditation, whispering technique, visualization and living in the end. Nothing worked, so I added doing affirmation, self-love meditation, and the Ho'oponopono prayer. I did all of these techniques really just to get her back. I was scared of losing her and because of desperation. I even contacted some of your interviewed success stories, but only Gabby P replied. She let me join her Law of Attraction group, and in that group I met good people from different countries who are willing to listen to you, give you advice, and cheer you up, especially when you are down. I even tried everything Law of Attraction, as in everything. And aside from doing LOA, I also bought her flowers and gifts from time to time, hoping that she might change her mind. Ten months had passed and still no result. Oh, I was losing hope and also losing myself. I was tired of everything. I realized that I didn't prioritize myself. Because all I did during those 10 months was try everything just to get her back. So I decided to go no contact and just do the whole upon a prayer and self-love meditation 100% for myself and in order for me to heal. Honestly, everything. Even though I did it 100% for myself, there was still 20 to 40% thought that doing these two techniques might be the key for her to come back. To me, in short, I was still holding on and afraid that I might lose her forever. Finally, January 2019, I don't know what happened, but I just woke up and I felt different. I loved myself. I felt happy, secure, empowered, content with my life. I had accepted everything and I kept saying to myself, new year, new life. And I decided to let go completely. Not because I didn't love her anymore, or I was tired of chasing her, but because I realized that it was time to move forward. I'm happy for my SP and I love her so much that I'm willing to walk away if that's what makes her happy. So I let go mentally, emotionally, and wholeheartedly. Two weeks later after letting go, I received a miracle. Whew. Thank you, Agnes, for changing my life. You are like an angel sent by God. Thank you for teaching me how to love myself, and thank you for this wonderful knowledge about the law of attraction. Yes, the law of attraction work. You just have to believe and let go. Thank you, Jim. I do think that letting go is a huge component of things coming to you because you can do the techniques for some time but like Jim, if you're still doing it to hang on and get them back, you're still doing it to get. 
get them. Get them, get them, get them. You have to get to the point where you let go, not of the desire, but let go of the get them part and be able to, as Jim said here, I love her so much that I'm willing to walk away if that's what makes her happy. So in that moment, Jim put the desire that he had on the back burner and wished her unconditional love, I think. So wonderful, wonderful story. I will put down in the description everything that Jim used to manifest his specific person. I know some of you have asked me for more male specific person success stories. I cannot um, manufacture them. They just come in when they come in. I do look out for them, obviously, because we do get a lot more women sending them in. But hopefully this other one from Jim will be the beginning of more to come. Now, I will also put down below the playlist of all the other success stories that have been done on this subject of manifesting a specific person. So, lots of love everyone. Have a wonderful weekend wherever you are in the world, morning, noon or night. And I will see you in the next YouTube.